Tonight we're hearing from a local mother after parish leaders announced a historic Catholic school in Shiviet will close its doors for good by the end of the school year. Simone Jameson joins us live with the latest. That's right, Rob. Multiple parents are up in arms after they say they received a letter from leaders of St. Martin of Tours Catholic School in Shiviet announcing that the school will be closing for good once the school year is up. It's a decision these parents tell me blindsided them, leaving them with more questions than answers. They're very small and tight knit, and as a school community, it's just very devastating to all of us. Shock and disappointment are among the emotions some parents say they are feeling after receiving this letter on December 15th from Reverend Matthew Robin announcing St. Martin's of Tours School in Shiviet will be closing at the end of the school year. I don't know how a man of God can put it out there right before the holidays. That could have waited until the first of the year. It's just been my home. I and mean, my family's been part of St. Martin's for well over 40 years. Over 100 years. Um, it's just sad to see that staple in Shiviet not be there anymore. Representatives of the Archdiocese of Cincinnati say the pastor, pastoral council, and finance council recommended closing the school after evaluating its viability. In a release they share with Fox 19 Now Tuesday, school leaders say over the last five years, St. Martin of Tours School has incurred a cumulative deficit of 1.9 million. This deficit is projected to grow to 2.3 million by the end of the school year. They went on to say despite parish cost cutting measures that have reduced annual expenses, the trend is not projected to improve. When this first started in around 2020, it was Beacon to Light. Um, we were told that we would have at least five years and that we would be merging, that no schools would officially close, that they would just merge into one school. The Archdiocese of Cincinnati says the drop in revenue is the result of declining donations, tuition and enrollment, and that the parish can no longer afford to subsidize the school. The mothers I spoke with say they are skeptical about how the money is being spent. We don't know where any of this money is going. We believe that, you know, there's something else going on that they're not telling us. These parents tell me they learned of St. Martin's financial misfortune after receiving this letter from school leaders in October. They believe if they had known the school was in financial trouble sooner, they could have prevented it from closing. It means so much to us. We could have reached out to, you know, people, sponsors, and we could have found a way to help raise money, you know, to help save the school had we known. And these mothers tell me they also fear that once St. Martin Catholic School closes, that the church will be next. They say they're now looking into alternative schools for their kiddos, but are still remaining hopeful that something can be done to reverse the decision. Live in Shiviet, Simone Jameson, Fox 19 Now.